Out of New York State tonight, Governor Kathy, Co Kathy Hochul, rather, she has okayed legislation to increase compensation for workers' benefits. Today, our New York correspondent, Elise Klein, talks to lawmakers about how they see this impacting workers across the state. In June, towards the end of the most recent legislative session, New York State lawmakers passed a bill intending to increase the weekly minimum for New Yorkers who receive workers' compensation benefits. Last week, Governor Kathy Hochul signed this bill into law. Some New York State lawmakers say this compensation for temporary or partially disabled workers has not been increased in several years. We're trying to ensure that working uh, is protected, a worker is protected. If you get hurt in some type of temporary disability, you'll be able to survive in New York State financially. The current weekly benefits for workers' compensation is around $150 a week. The new law will essentially index this weekly benefit to inflation. Some Republican lawmakers express concern about this new law potentially driving business out of the state. The cost of doing business here is so much higher, and workers' compensation insurance is one of those reasons. Uh, literally, it's about 20 times more expensive in New York State uh, for workers' compensation insurance than it is for an equivalent business uh, in, in the state of Pennsylvania. Senator Sanders, the bill's sponsor, says increasing compensation benefits is crucial for workers to be able to pay their bills. This is not enough. You would go so far behind in your bills that you would rush back to work regardless of how healthy you feel. You would be forced back. Elise Klein, Erie News Now.